today we are moving a Peterson 5710 horizontal grinder for Barry Equipment from uh, their shop in South Windsor, Connecticut, going over to Danielson, Connecticut. Barry Equipment is a large equipment dealer in the Northeast. From what I understand, their staple brand is Tucson and Devlon. They deal in Peterson as well. We've moved equipment for them for quite a few years. The Barrys are very good friends of ours. We'll usually do what we can to help them out, especially on moves like this. We're in truck 21, uh, Peterbilt 389. It is a 285 wheelbase, 52 inch flat top sleeper, powered by a Cummins 605, backed by an 18 speed with a 390 rear end. This uh, truck is equipped with two speed rear ends as well. I got into this truck the end of summer of 2023 after I moved out of truck 22, the uh, black 389 sleeper that we have. As far as loading up these grinders, the conveyor end most of the time has to go towards the neck of the trailer just for fitment issues. If not, you'd need a trailer that's almost 40 foot in the hole in order to fit it the other way around. As far as rigging goes, I try to use the tracks as little as I can. I try to do at least half of the rigging to the chassis of the machines. Sometimes these machines don't have appropriate rigging points to secure to the chassis as much as you want to. Thankfully, these Petersons do have good chassis mounted points as far as securement goes. So when we left South Windsor, we uh, took 291 over to 84, down over to Route 2. We're taking Route 2 all the way down to 395 in Norwich, Connecticut, and uh, making our way up 395 over to Danielson. The unloading process on these is pretty simple. Blast the air out of the trailer and uh, unrig all the securement I have on the machine, at which point I will uh, set the trailer on the ground, pull the neck and the truck away, and that will give us room to set my ramps up and uh, track the machine right off and bring it right over to where the customer wants to set it up for their initial use.